to you guys in a pretty long time and I apologize for that I just have kind of been in like a creative rut I didn't know what to film wasn't really doing anything fun I did go to Universal with my family and Jupiter but I didn't want to film I wanted to like be in the moment this time and you guys have seen plenty of Universal vlogs if you have missed them definitely check them out on my channel they're super super fun some of my favorite videos but it's like the same thing every time so I thought I'll just enjoy it with my family this time. Anyways, if you remember from a couple videos back, you may have seen me mention that I am a UCA staffer. If you don't know what that is, I work for Varsity with the Universal Cheerleaders Association. And this summer, I've been going to different camps around Florida and Georgia and basically teaching a bunch of high school teams, middle school teams, some material, how to stunt, a pyramid, game day routine, all things cheerleading. I've already had one camp, which was in Perry, Florida. If y'all are watching this video, what's up? And then I also went to the Great Wolf Lodge to do training, which was pretty fun. Um, but tomorrow, actually, I have a camp in Georgia again. It is in Nashville, Georgia with Berrien High School, and I'm super excited. So I thought I would film this little journey. Um, the first camp I didn't film because I wanted to get a feel for things, see if I could film. And to be honest, this video might not have a lot of cheerleading content, but we're still going to travel. It's going to be a fun time. We're going to spend a little five-day trip together. I'm home. We're about to go on the boat. I'm actually going back to Gainesville today because it's a shorter drive to go to Georgia from Gainesville. So I'm gonna split up the drive a little bit. With that being said, let's have some fun. Nothing like your smile in the morning. Following the linings on your cheeks. got back from the boat and I actually just made a TikTok. I've been sitting here for a while making a TikTok. I also made an Instagram reel. So if you don't follow me on TikTok, my username is at Riley Nicole Andrews and then my Instagram is Riley Andrews. They're both in the description to make it easier for you. But it's really cute like cheer content so if you want to go watch it definitely definitely do that. Um, I'm already pretty much packed. All my stuff is right there. It's only like a three day camp, so it's not too bad. I think I'm going to get dinner with my family before I head back to Gainesville. I just wanted to pop on and give you a little update. By my side, It's Rob! <laughs> I want a target. I can't believe the best, the best. You go. Uh, I like talking about it. Yo. Yo. The target lighting is low key really good. $19 Fortnite card. Who wants it? This book was the best book I think I've ever read in my life. And it finally came to Target. And there's a couple other books by Colleen. So I think I'm gonna get this one. When I'm like at the beach, I don't want to go on my phone because my phone overheats. So I like to read books. That's what I was gonna say. So I needed a new book. I have to go. <laughs> Bye. And we are on the road to Gainesville. All right, I just got back to the apartment in Gainesville. We're in Gainesville now. And I also did a little material refresh for tomorrow. Tomorrow I'm teaching some material, so I want to make sure that I have it down pack ready to teach. Um, also, also I'm going to write down my schedule that we're doing for these next three days in my little staff notebook. We have this cutie little staff notebook that I like to peek at during camp. Don't like being on my phone. The schedule is on my phone right now, so I'm just going to transfer that schedule into my little notebook. Um, but other than that, I think I'm going to watch the new Obi-Wan episode tonight. And that's really all I have planned. <laughs> the camp doesn't start until 11.45 tomorrow, so I have some time. I'm gonna wake up, take my time, maybe get some Starbucks, and we'll head to camp. Good morning. 
I just finished getting ready. I'm all packed to go. We have like an hour, actually like 35, 40 minutes before I like to get on the road. So it's perfect. I'm gonna go run by Starbucks, fill up my gas tank and hit the road. Let me show you the outfit. Here's the outfit of the day. Me and my other coworker, staff instructor are wearing the same thing. Everything is from Varsity. So my bow is Varsity. Polo tank is from Varsity since so UCA staff. The back is really cute too. I don't know if you can see that, but yo. And then the shorts are Varsity as well. They're actually really pretty comfortable. I didn't think they're gonna be like stretchy or whatever, but they are. And then my shoes are Varsity as well. We're allowed to wear Apple watches. This is very helpful when I need to look at the time. Just have a white band because it matches. <laughs> we do have to take these off for stunting. But other than that, we can wear them all camp. I have some snacks packed in my bag, some freeze dried fruit, and some Skittles when I need that little pick me up. But yeah, I don't know how much cheer content I'll be getting this camp. Maybe I'll have the girls say hi when the camp is over. I don't know yet. We'll play by ear. But yeah, here's what I look like. I'm gonna go hit the road. Like a happy child I've officially made it to the high school. I am very early though. It's currently 11.10 and we start at 11.45. So I have some time to kill. I bought lunch. We don't have a lunch break today because, because we start at 12. So I just got this little cheese and fruit protein box from Starbucks. And I think I'm just gonna review some material, touch up my hair and makeup, eat my lunch, and then we will start camp. So if I don't talk to you during camp, I'll definitely talk to you when I can. <laughs> we just got done with day one of camp. I'm exhausted and starving. I went and got Subway. TBH, this is like the middle of nowhere. There's not a whole lot of food options. There was like McDonald's or Subway or Dairy Queen or like sit down restaurants and I definitely don't want to sit down. I want to go home and shower. So I'm on the way to the hotel. The hotel is about 20 minutes from where the high school is that we're doing the camp at. Um, I was gonna introduce you to the team, but when we finished, they uh, were passing around their new practice wear, which is very exciting. But I didn't want to interrupt and be like, hey guys, get my vlog because the coach is trying to talk and I was just gonna let her do her thing. Okay, we still have two more days. I will definitely introduce you guys at some point. Georgia's so cute. They all have little Southern accents. It's adorable. We taught them a lot today. We taught them three cheers, a dance, multiple stunt variations, and they picked it up really, really quickly, which I'm very proud of you guys, if you're watching this. Tomorrow, I think we're teaching them a pyramid. We are teaching them another dance, band chant, fan chant, just like stuff that they can do at games and stuff. And then the last day is like all American tryouts. That brings some fun opportunities for the girls. What else are we doing? Um, evaluations, credentialing. If you've been to UCA camp, you know the vibes. It is so hot here though. It says on my car right now that it is 100 degrees. It was 104 when I left the gym. And my car almost didn't start, so I'll keep you updated on that. Hopefully, I'm not stranded in Georgia in the middle of nowhere and no way to get back home. Probably won't bring the camera out in the hotel room because what? we're not gonna do anything. We're just gonna chill. I'm gonna eat my dinner. I'm gonna shower and just watch some TikToks or TV, something. I'm just gonna have a relaxing night. It's only 6.15, but I will be sleeping by 8 p.m. Tomorrow we start at 9 a.m. I will most likely just see you tomorrow and I will show you what the outfit is for tomorrow. Here's the hashtag room tour. Here's our view, we actually have a pool view. Don't know that I'll be swimming in that cloudy little pool, but anyways, oh, there's my car. Good morning, it's camp day two, woo! I'm drinking my coffee on the way to the high school right now, wearing my favorite outfit, listening to my favorite song. Are you ready for it? I don't think you're ready for it. This is called Mic Drop. Okay, 
Okay, I just got here and I put my little sun shield up so nobody can see me. <laughs> no, but it actually yesterday got so hot My car almost did not start. There was like a heat advisory in Nashville, Georgia Heat advisory car almost didn't start. I'm pretty sure that was why it actually looks like it's gonna rain today So hopefully no heat advisory Anyway, I was gonna show you my favorite outfit. This is the blue tank top that we wear it says UCA staff same shorts on same cheer shoes on you can't see that but um white bow white apple watch band it looks pretty dang good if i do say so myself all right i'm gonna go in it's about 8 45 we start at nine it's gonna be a great day i'll hopefully be able to show you my team <laughs> what are we doing we're gonna what say we happy day two yeah happy day two uh, we're gonna be famous ready? Yeah, we're happy ready. day two Just got back to our room eating the rest of my nuggets that I didn't finish from lunch earlier. I went to McDonald's. It was just quick, easy. There's not too much around here, so I didn't have very many options. Um, camp went well today. Again, they learned a lot today. And apparently they are stalking all of my YouTube videos, so it's actually really funny. I might actually go down to the gym. There's like a little fitness center here. I'm not too tired today. Yesterday I was way more tired. We still have one more day and then I'm driving home also tomorrow. Well, home back to Gainesville, not home home yet. But yeah, I thought I'd give a little update. We'll see where the rest of the day takes us. waffle this morning and it was so good um this today's flavor was cinnamon roll not strawberry a little disappointed they didn't have the strawberry but the cinnamon roll was pretty darn good if you couldn't tell i'm on my way to the last day of camp um oh i have a story so yesterday i didn't mention it but i didn't vlog in the car because it was literally monsooning outside it was raining so hard the roads like come out of nowhere and i have to turn in random places that i don't like I don't know my way around here, so I was being extra, extra cautious. My car caught a couple times and like kind of slid, but not really. Um, anyway, so it was monsooning and I was passing by this little field and the field had cows. There are so many cows, they were adorable, but it was raining so hard and there was only like one tree and like picture like 50 cows trying to huddle under one tree. It was so sad that I almost cried because I was sad for the cows. They need more trees. They're all like getting hit by the rain. It was so sad, I literally almost cried. <laughs> Good morning, it's day three. Last day, we're going back to Gainesville today. Woo! Okay, another thing. What is it with places in the middle of nowhere in the morning smells? Like what? So I'm in Nashville, Georgia right now. My last camp was in Perry, Florida very very similar places it's like middle of nowhere right barely any people very small town but like what is the smell i mean i guess if you know you know but if you don't know there's this doo-doo smell every morning when i walk outside the hotel and i still smell it it's like in my car now it's really gross anyways so you okay Tell me what is with it with Georgia being hotter than Florida. Isn't it supposed to be cooler than Florida? Anyways, I just filled up my gas. Totally forgot to say goodbye. Anyway, camp's over. Ah, so sad. It's been a great time. Um, I have a two hour drive back home. Let's pray that I can make it through without falling asleep. I'm sure I'll be fine. I'm actually pretty awake right now. I had a coffee at lunch not too long ago. So we're just gonna drive home. It's about a two hour and three minute drive, which isn't bad. So I think we can do it. I'll see you when we get home.